Brought to you by 1AAuto.com, your source for quality replacement parts and the best service on the internet. Hi, I'm Don from 1A Auto. I hope this how-to video helps you out. And the next time you need a part for your vehicle, think of 1AAuto.com. Thanks. In this video, we're going to show you how to replace a blower motor on this 2002 Suzuki XL7. And it's the same part and process for these vehicles from 2001 to 2002. And the items you'll need for this is a new blower motor from 1AAuto.com, a 10mm wrench, a flat blade screwdriver, and an 8mm socket and ratchet with an extension and a swivel. You want to start off by removing these two clips here. And to remove them, you just pry out the center and pull them free. And that panel pulls off. Then you want to disconnect this series of harnesses. Just push the tabs on the top and pull them free. Next you want to disconnect these harnesses from that bracket. Just use a flat blade screwdriver and push those clips through. Now using your 10 millimeter wrench, you want to remove this bolt, then loosen this bolt right here, and remove this bolt right up here. And we'll just fast forward as Don does this. With those bolts removed, you can just pull that module down and out. Push the tab on this harness and pull it free. Now you want to remove this 8mm bolt, this 8mm bolt, and then the one right back here. And to remove the one in the back here, you're going to need a swivel on an extension. Just reach that up in there, put it on there. You may need to use a flashlight to help you see it. And once you get it loosened, just get your hand up there and remove it the rest of the way by hand. And you'll notice he does that with these ones as well. Now to get the blower motor out, you're going to need to disconnect these two white clips. Pull straight out on them. And now pl pull the blower motor down. And you can see that it's getting caught on something. On the back, there's a larger piece of plastic on the blower motor and it's hitting the firewall. Just push it back up into place if this is happening. And then twist it. And then pull it down again. On the right is the old blower motor, on the left is the new one from 1A Auto. You can see they're identical and they'll mount exactly the same. Take your new blower motor, pull down on that harness and feed the blower motor up into place. And if it gets caught right here, you can just give it a light hit. And just put it into position. And we'll just fast forward as Don replaces those three 8mm bolts. So those are tightened up. Reconnect your harness. And then push these white clips back in. Replace your module. And then replace those bolts. And you can see he puts them in by hand and then tightens them up with that 10 millimeter wrench.
Now reconnect your harnesses and push those harness clips back into those brackets. and take that panel and put it back up into place and replace those two clips. And when you replace those, you still want the center to be pulled out. And then push the clip in and push the center in to lock it. And then you're all set. We hope this video helps you out. Brought to you by 1AAuto.com, your source for quality replacement parts and the best service on the internet. Please feel free to call us toll free, 888-844-3393. We're the company that's here for you on the internet and in person.